All right. Let's do it. Here we go. 10601 2014 Bowman Chrome football case. I got Carlino, Carlino, Fog, McIntyre, Fog, Birchfield, Fog, Slayback, Celio, Celio, Fog, Lang, Vargas. Let me uh, rephrase my Bradford statement too. Like, dude, he was the best option they had. I mean, what a good trade! They they got they traded away their their first round pick to get, um, you know, for Eagles. I'm talking about to get Wentz. Then they trade away Bradford to get a first round pick. He goes to the team that's not healthy. Everybody's winning. I mean, it was like the perfect storm. That was that was. Good deal. Five times. One, two, three, four, five. Vargas on top, Birchfield on bottom, everybody in between. Because, you know, usually with sports trades, like, it's, it's a, it's like, dude, one team does it to lose, to, to cut money. Other team makes out real big. The other team gets shit on. You know, like that team, that trade, dude, no, there was no loser. It was awesome. I love that. Cardinals and Falcons go to Vargas. Lang gets the Ravens. Fogg gets the Bills. Slayback gets the Panthers. Fogg gets the Bears. Vargas gets the Bengals. Birchfield gets the Browns. Cowboys go to Carlino. Vargas gets the Broncos. Fogg goes Lions, Packers, Texans. Colts go to Carlino. Celio gets the Jags. Slayback gets the Chiefs. Vargas gets the Dolphins. Carlino gets the Vikings. Fogg gets the Patriots. Vargas gets the Saints. Celio gets the Giants. I mean, there's so many. Look at all those good teams in a set in a row. McIntyre gets the Jets. Celio gets the Raiders. Celio balled. Fogg gets the Eagles. Steelers go to Fogg. Vargas gets the Chargers. McIntyre gets the Niners. Carlino gets the Seahawks. Celio gets the Rams. Vargas gets the Bucks. Titans go to Jesse Lang. Birchfield gets the skins. Keep in mind, this is 2014 football. Not 2015, 2014. Um, trade deadline, I'm opening up some packs. There's a lot of them, so. You got time. There's your list again. Any trades want to be made? Have at it. Let's fill that five star while we're at it, boys. I haven't opened this stuff in a while. Tomorrow night for halftime break, I'm probably going to do one of the inner cases of Supreme or the other half of Origins that I have up. Uh, and a Leaf Auto full-size helmet, if interested in that. Hopefully you are. Or something along those lines. Maybe I won't do the half case. Maybe I'll do them as a mixer or something. But I think the half case is kind of cool because there's a bunch, you know, a bunch of odds in it. You know, I always talk about 14. And I always and I mentioned the guys that are in the draft. And I don't mention one guy who you'd think I would mention like first, being that I'm a fan. My man Devontae Freeman. You haven't noticed? He's good. Lewis says the Patriots are up for trade. 
and the Steelers, if anyone's interested in that. Well, these are fun. Uh, Martavius Bryant, is he 14 also, or is he 13? I know he's suspended for the year, but I think Martavius Bryant's a wide receiver one on half the teams in the league. He's good. Any of you guys listen to ESPN Radio, like in the mornings? Coleman's 15, though. Oh, Coleman's a beast. Dude, I said last year, I mean, I was in a break last year uh, when, when Bowman first came out. Case break. And I bought, I bought something like, because uh, it was the first first uh, set with, with free, Freeman Autos of, like, decent, something decent. And uh, I had something like six teams. I didn't land on any good ones. I traded all my teams for Atlanta, and everyone's like, what are you doing? I said, I'm going after the guy who I think is going to be Rookie of the Year. <clears throat> I was talking about Coleman. The Rookie Year wasn't that great. But dude, Tevin Coleman's a beast. You guys are seeing that now. The kid is good. Yeah! Okay, so, Lewis, you're exactly what I was about to talk about. The Dan Levitard show today was so weird, dude. It was so weird. It was so weird. Like, they were arguing the whole time. I don't necessarily mind Mike Mike. Um... Dude, the Levitard show this morning was so strange. It was him and that dude's two guys just, like, arguing. Talking about how they didn't like each other. <laughs> and I'm like, what? Just like a yesterday or a couple days ago, they, they were, like, getting along fine. I thought that was always part of the show. You know, like, they were bickering. Apparently, apparently it's not. Yeah, I, dude, Lewis, I feel like he's, like... He, like, committed some career suicide, kind of. Beasley, Beasley hasn't been anywhere near what I was hoping he'd be. He had a great game Sunday. He hadn't done shit otherwise, dude. He needs to keep playing well. Because what we got left in five-star? Six still left in five-star? Let's fill that up. Get us a... Get us a Bryant. I was going to say a Trout... Right now, I think we need to get us a Bryant. Oh my god, that's on TV too. It's so weird. I forgot that. Any trades are going to happen you've got from now until I open the last pack in the last stack of this first half of the case. And you've got time to try to maneuver some deals or whatever you want to do. The blue. Some blue auto. Well, he kept like the dudes to guys finally were saying he's like, he's like, you have made it uncomfortable for everyone here. He's like, nobody wants to talk. Oh my god, I'm cracking up in the car. I'm like, these guys aren't even talking about anything. <laughs> Any interest in a uh, in a FanDuel league? For this weekend, you seem to always fill.
<sighs> what else? What other game? Well, who plays tomorrow night? Denver and uh, San Diego, right? Watch San Diego mess around and win that game. I don't really think that's going to happen. Watch that happen. How about Carolina Panthers? That's plate. Oh. Reggie Bush, one of one plate for Detroit. Why does my iPad do that? We got six left, I believe, in five star baseball case. Panthers are garbage. I know it. It's amazing. Then we got ten left in triple threads, three box from a sealed case. So it'll be from a from a sealed inner, from a sealed case. I mean, very good possibility of pulling the master case hit out of just that three box. This case, dude, has been sitting over here in my pile of inventory for a long time. I forgot I even had it. I didn't even have it listed until not too long ago. Like I was looking through all this stuff. I was like, oh my god, I got this and this and this. I got Immaculate Baseball single boxes at $15.50 for two random teams. I mean, decent stuff. Cheap price. Five star case is seventy nine dollars for two randoms. I got twenty fifteen Supreme Football up. I'm doing it by the inner case. Keep the cost down. Uh, two random teams are forty seven bucks. The uh, Mariota Shield that I pulled, I guess, was purchased by Super Break, and then it was just pulled by another breaker um, the other night. You saw me post that. Yeah, they said boom. I was like, man, come on, dog. Yeah, it's exciting. It isn't as exciting the second time around. Come on now. Unless you hit it, and then it's like, yeah, cool. Triple Threads Mini has four left. If we can get five star down to one left, I'll take the last spot if, if it needs to be that way. So if anyone wants to get in there and we get it down that low, if I have to, I'll take the last spot and fill it. Baseball playoff time. It is time <clears throat> to, uh, do you guys really think the Cubs? I don't think the Cubs, man. I'll tell you what, I think the Cubs last night, I didn't watch, uh, but I think the Cubs last night, 
I think they all went back in their locker room and said, dude, we we got lucky on that, I think. Because if that would have gone game five, man, you know these Cub fans around here, you guys aren't from here, but dude, they would have been on, because they would have been so nervous the whole thing. I was at this meeting all day at work in Chicago, and all the good people that worked, you know, with there or whatever that were there. Oh yeah, go Cubs, go Cubs! I'm like man, yo, y'all wasn't saying that last night. Y'all was scared to death for that uh, normal Cubs blow up. I think it's coming. Call me crazy. Oh, there's a red. There's a red. I just seen some red. Uh oh. Uh oh. There's not a mini for five star. I already filled. I haven't had a chance to post it yet. But I did just see a red. Red auto and chrome is numbered what? Five? That'd be. Let's see. Good luck, fellas. Trade deadline's off. Let's go. No, 14 chrome. Jeremy Hill, Bowman's best die cut. All cards do ship all the time. Robert Quinn Pulsar for the Rams. So do not worry about that. Sammy Watkins. Sankey die cut mini. OBJ rookie, Sammy Watkins die cut. My phone just doesn't stop, dude, ever. It's crazy. Kelvin Benjamin. Mike Wallace Black, the Dolphins. First hit, Dion Buchanan, 143 of 199, auto for the Cardinals. And as always, guys, every auto, every case that I do, short print auto gets a free grade. What up, Joe Courtney? Just saw you there. So there's your 143, the short print so far. I don't think it's going to last, especially if that red holds to what I think. Yeah, auto. Michael Sam. Yeehaw. Savage. Archer Blue. Dominique Easley. Refractor Auto for the Patriots. Going to Lewis. Bow. Five star baseball. There's still at six left. One left in the Triple Threads Mini. I'm going to need some help with the list. Because I can't type names on it apparently right now. If somebody can help do that. It would be great. Mike Evans Mini Die Cut. Jordan Reed. Four. Cam Newton Blue, Aaron Murray Die Cut, CJ Mosley Pulsar, Sankey, 61 of 99 on what I call the Coral Auto, whether or not that's actually what it's called, I don't know. Joe Courtney, man, how you been, brother? You're a baseball dude. I got six left in five-star baseball case. 61 and 99. Thank you. Going to Tennessee, Jesse Lang. Come some gold. Mike Davis, gold, Oakland. 
Top Shelf Rookie Pulsar Refractor Auto. Jarvis Landry. Nice. Miami. J.J. Vargas. Landry, a baller. Here you go, bro. Very nice. Someone said two left. Two left and what, Chris? Trey Millard. Or Millard Black. Johnny Manziel on that mini die cut. Johnny Manziel. <laughs> Moncrief. I mean, look at this class. This class is nuts. Moncrief for the Colts. Carlino. Thanks, Chris. Is that one of one for Reggie Bush as a lion in the plate? Could be in carry for the Bears. Sankey on the die cut. Anthony Barr, Pulsar from Minnesota. McCarran on the die cut. Brandon Marshall, Black, Bears. Trey Mason on that mini die cut. Could be McCarran. Pierre Garcon Black, Khalil Mack Black, Triple Threads Mini is full, Bortles, Jordan Matthews, how many was that for? Terrence West Pulsar, how many was that for in the Triple Threads? How many winners? I gotta take them spots down. Ellington Black. Easily Pulsar. Troy Nicholas Auto for Arizona. Vargas. Top two. All right, thank you. Take those spots down now. That leaves eight left in that break. Three box triple threads. Top cut breaks at gmail.com. They all probably know it. You can drop it there. That'd be awfully helpful. What up, June? Taj Boyd. June had the longest wait for mail ever. Eric Hebron for me. How long did it take June a year? Hebron, red, 10 of 25. Who, by the way, Eric Hebron is balling. Detroit. Lewis Fogg. Lewis, I'm going to tell you, I will grade this if you want, but I think there's a little dimple in that sticker. I don't think it'll grade the way you want. Wasn't my fault, though, June. He was pissed at me, though. Dude was pissed. Dude was so pissed. I was like, dude, I sent it. I swear to God. I swear to God. I mailed it. And I did. Mailed it like next day. But, uh, 
got hung up somewhere or something, dude. It took forever. Calvin Benjamin blue. It was so weird. He's messaging me. He's like, he's like, dude, you never sent my mail. Evans. I'm like, yes, I did. It was flawless basketball from like two years ago. Bishop Sankey black. Paul Richardson. OBJ on the mini die cut. Kevin Benjamin mini die cut. Cody Latimer. Ryan Matthews blue. Teddy Bridge. Kevin Benjamin. Kareem Martin Pulsar. Eric Ibram mini die cut. Alshon Black. Yeah, I'm out of flawless, man. Broke the last box I had tonight. Jake Matthews, ATL. JJ Vargas. Go Falcons. All right, first half of the case is done. Get the other half opened up and keep moving along. Fill that five star. We can do it. need to go to the bathroom or anything, good time. Good time to do it. <laughs> Get yourself a cold one, a little, a little cocktail.
Chad Rogers just posted pictures of his house with all the flooding damage. Oh my god. For like a while, JJ. left to five star baseball 2016 last case of it I have Let's fill that thing up I got you, JJ. Baby's doing like a week. And I know my, my wife to me said, uh, she's like, Brad, we got like 33 more days. And I'm like, holy shit. I think 30 days and she'd be considered full term. Something like that. Hey. Man, I got two other kids, dude. Get some sleep. Dude, listen to this. I woke up yesterday at 3.30 in the morning. 3.30 in the morning yesterday after watching the full Cubs game. I watched the entire game, which ended at like, what, like quarter to two? Something like that. So I got like an hour and a half sleep. I drove all the way my happy ass to work, which is an hour away. Got there after eating breakfast, getting ready, right? Got there walking the door at 5. Uh, maybe, maybe like 5.10. Had to do my full inventory count. Takes a while. Do the entire thing. Takes. Uh, I was done submitting uh, the first copy of it, right? Because then it gives you like a, okay, go back and count this. Like if you, if you miss stuff or if you have a variance for what they say that you have in inventory. And then it'll give you another 100 items to go back and just scan all those barcodes. I clicked the first one, though, after everything was done. Fucking thing pops up, says, error. I said, huh? No, I said, huh? And uh, so I, like, close that out. I resubmit it. It said, error. Try again. And, uh, dude, I, I wasted my whole day. So you know what I get to do? I get to go do it again tomorrow. 
after today waking up an hour earlier than normal. And um, going to that meeting in Chicago all day. Friday, my boss is coming and doing a full audit on my store. Oh, it's like, dude, come on, man. <laughs> like, this week sucks. But I do have Saturday and Sunday off. Saturday, Vols, Bama. Sunday, Falcons, Seahawks. It's going to be a good time. Oh, okay, God, we got six left in five, in, oh, I'm sorry, five star. Let's fill that break. It's baseball playoff time. We need to bust some baseball. Lewis you should see it today at this meeting, right? They it's all the store managers from like the Midwest for uh um for for T Mobile, right? And they break us up into different groups like throughout the day and they had us go to like these different like little training sessions. And um The last one I'm going to do, they have a guy from the like the, the business side, right? And he's talking to us about trying to get them leads to close more business lines, you know, blah, 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 this and that, whatever. He's like, here, I'm going to demonstrate what we do. Uh, you know, and try and make some calls and see if I can't get lucky and, and schedule an appointment for you guys, you know, so you can see it. He makes a call and schedules an appointment. Everybody in the room, dude, Lewis, everybody in the room is like, man, it's like Wolf of Wall Street. This is awesome. And I was like, man, y'all ain't, they, they, they want shit. <laughs> Another one on the plate, Chris Johnson for the Jets, with the Jets at that time. And um, everyone's like, looking around. That's why I made that post on Facebook. I was like, man, I would tear this dude apart on the phone. Triple Threads, I think, has eight left. There's a video I need to run on the uh, on the website or on the page for a two-spot winner mini. That's the three boxer, and then Five Star Paul has a uh, has a uh, six left. Calvin just said he was going to take one, so that would be five left. Oh, Lewis, dude, I called my so I called after the meeting right before I went live here. I called and talked to the regional vice president. Who's my old boss when I worked at Sprint? He transferred over to T-Mobile, which is how I got my job. And um, I said, "Hey, man, I don't know if you know this. You know, obviously, obviously it's been a long time since you interviewed me, and, and blah blah blah." So I'm a resume. I'm like, "But my background was this." And I said, "If you ever need to put a training together or anything like that for, for these guys on the phone, I said I'll guarantee you right now I'm 100% the most qualified individual to do that in T-Mobile in the entire company." He started laughing. And I was like, no, bro. <laughs> I promise you, I am. <laughs> I started talking to him more. I was like, when I was 16, I was the leading salesperson at a telemarketing company. When I was 18, I was the nighttime manager of that company, the youngest manager in the entire nation. I was like, when I was after college, I worked at this, you know, at, so, talking about doing mortgages, blah, blah, blah. Then I worked up to owning my own business and being a part of the executive uh, committee on that company, and this and that, whatever, and I opened my own three other businesses here in my town, and I sold them all, and then I went to work for Chase and was on the phone, I'm like, you want to know something about being on the phone, bro? I was like, I own the phone. <laughs> I own it, and he's like, oh, why haven't you considered doing that job, and I was like, what do you think I'm calling you for? You know, and he's like, call me next week, let's talk, I want to know more about this, I'm like, all right. 
Paul McIntyre says he'll grab a spot in something just now. Yeah, they don't know, bro. That's Murderous on that phone. Phone's off. Tannehill. <laughs> you told him what? I know four people in the world that can hold a candle to me. <laughs> Carlos Hyde. Who else was it? Harper? Kadeem Carey. Who was the who was the who was the other two? Harper's been on the phone too. Zalsner? Was Zalsner one of them? Julius Thomas, Pulsar. Jordan Matthews. Mini Dadcott. Carlos Hyde. Paul Calvin just said on Facebook, he said, five star, come on, Robert Quinn Red, 23 of 25 for the Rams. Harper, Seth, and maybe Zalzner, Black Moncrief. I never, I never thought Seth was that good. Alan Hearns, Jacksonville. Pete Celio. But isn't he like a lawyer now or something like that? Then he was. Could be him carry Pulsar. Chris Johnson on that one of one plate for the Jets. Isaiah Crowell, Cleveland, kid playing real well. Dave Birchfield. <laughs> oh, the good old days, dude. Those days were those days were those days were fun. So me and Lewis used to work together. We did mortgages, right? And um, it was a real competitive place, and real fast. I mean, you would talk about the movie like Boiler Room. That's where we worked. Ebron and um, Freeman on the die cut. And I remember like we had a we were sitting there one day, and I had a, I had a bunch of guys who I trained. I had a team, Justin Gilbert, from Cleveland. And uh, they were all, they'd be all on the phone trying to get like me leads and I'd close the deal. Latimer. And I'm sitting there yelling at him one day, Watkins. And I'm like, man, you, you know, you got to do it like this, do it like that, whatever. And I'm like, give me the phone. I'll show you right now. And like, usually if you call somewhere, I mean, the odds of the, anyone else picking up the phone are pretty slim to none, you know? This lady picks up the phone, dude. And we, our goal, our, what we were trying to do to, to start business with them, Aaron Murray was to get them to commit to ordering an appraisal. And to do that, they had to pay for it, and they'd give us their credit card over the phone, OBJ. I got this lady to answer the phone, commit to doing business, Jeremy Hill Pulsar, give me her credit card, order the appraisal, and have it paid and hung up in 30 seconds. And everyone was like, what the fuck? And I was like, that's how you do it. I walked out the room like, holy shit, that was the luckiest call ever. It was so cool. And they all said, like, nobody could say nothing anymore. Like, I was like, now you listen to me, Jordan Matthews. It was awesome. That was awesome. Lynch Black. Not that you guys care about that, but Jarvis Landry. A little story about me. Carlos Hyde Black. Another guy from 14 knows the stud. That's a stud. Sammy Watkins. Taylor Lewan Black. Dion Buchanan again, Otto, Arizona, JJ Vargas. Colt 
Lyrla? I don't know who that is. Green Bay. Lewis Fogg. Jeremy Hill, Teddy Bridge, I need a big auto, eh, the Wagner was nice, let's do something better, Jordan Reed, Pulsar, Bortles, Mini Die Cut, Anthony Barr, Blue Auto, 21 of 199, Minnesota. Minnesota goes to Sam Carlino. Richard Rogers Black, Andrew Luck Black, I think this is two boxes here, so a total of two boxes left to show, Latimer Black, Devontae Freeman, my man, Marquise Lee, Forte Pulsar, Jimmy Garrott, Manziel, Jordan Matthews in that menu die cut. Kids are good too. John Brown, 19 of 99. This one is 61 of 99. John Brown is now the short print auto. It's Arizona. JJ Vargas. Drew Brees Blue, Xavier Grimble, Alfred Morris Black, Karen Murray, Derek Carr, Savage, AJ McCarron, 57 of 99, this one was 19 of 99, McCarron for Cincinnati, JJ Vargas, last bit here, Tavon Austin Pulsar. And there it is. There's your case.